Hey, we're live on uh, YouTube doing some some indie next fest stuff again. Checking out a, another demo. Uh, we're checking out Dredge today, which is a game by Black Salt Games, published by Team Seventeen. You may know Team Seventeen for games like uh, Worms, for example, uh, The Escapist. There's all kinds of incredible games that they have published. Uh, so I have a ton of faith in this game to be another uh, very very good game. This is a single player fishing adventure RPG. With a sinister undercurrent, we're going to sell our catch, upgrade our boat, and dredge the depths for long-buried secrets. I'm excited for this. Uh, we can apparently play Chapter 1 of the game, so this is the, the demo is Chapter 1. Uh, but a fishing RPG exploration game with a mystery sounds like a damn dream. Okay, it sounds like a damn dream. So, uh, sure, let's get this show on the road. I will begin. Apparently hitting F did not... Oh, I gotta hold it down. It's an incredible clicking sound. I enjoyed that a lot. Okay, welcome to Dredge. Beautiful game as well. I, I immediately... I, I feel like my face covering up the... The title. You know what? I'm, I'm going back down here. I'm going back down here. That's fine. I love it. Let's, let's do it. New game. Dredging the depths. It's a great just... It's a great word, dredge. The title is just edge. Angler wanted. Is true. <laughs> Boy, I've seen better days. <laughs> I have seen some better days. This is me in like 40 years. This is me driving away from all the Isaac and Brotato fanboys. I love the art style, man. Art style is beautiful. Stereotypical old fisherman look. Honestly, yeah. Alright. Dude, look at this cute little city. The morning light fills your eyes as you try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock when, where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. This is Orbital. Without any doubt in my mind. Welcome to Greater Marrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Are you are you not having perfect vision? Are you blind, you idiot? I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged. I've had a few of your locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later. I'll let you get out there and catch some fish. I uh, hope you're feeling better. Can you start uh, feeding our our ecosystem here? Hope you don't have any uh, head trauma from crashing your boat into rocks, but uh, Papa's got to eat, so see if you can fill your cargo while you get some bearings. Pursuit added. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Okay. Um, sure, so I can undock. Let's hit tab real quick. Oh my lordy, dude. Look at my cargo. This is super cool. Okay. So we can see our boat speed. We can see how much damage we've taken. Looks like we're going to have a... Um, like a, a backpack hero... Uh, a Escape from Tarkov style inventory. Where I will be uh, putting stuff into my, my cargo. I love that already. Um, let's see our pursuits. Catch a fish or two. Okay. <laughs> okay. Met the mayor of Greater Marrow. Sent me out to catch some fish. Seems nice enough. Warn me to be back before nightfall. Okay. Let's let's do it. Um, got some encyclopedia action going too. What the frick? The open ocean, the exotic. Oh my god, the volcanic. Okay, lot to see. Lot to see. Um, let's undock. Move forward with W, S to reverse, turn with A and D. I I've learned how to drive in a video game before. What if I just crash into the jagged rocks again? Adjust the height with scroll wheel oh no adjust the height by by doing this oh now this is this is freaking scenic man okay um move to a fishing spot look for splashes and then press f to start fishing okay so i, I gotta be on oh there we go okay fantastic so i will start fishing and then we we pull okay cool cod Oh, I'll put my cod right in here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, take a look at my cod. Okay. 
I I am a big fan of this fishing mini game. That's pretty good. Oh, dude. I mean, this is this is already. I love the, I love the resource management in this. That's kind of cool. Stock depleted. Okay, this is just disturbed water now. Fitting stuff in this inventory is a is a fantastic UI. I'm loving it a lot. Two kissing cods. Hell yeah, baby. Okay, so that's just another town over there. Can I, like, leave the town that I'm in and then go to the new, new ta uh, town and... Oh, you can't, you can't over-pull in an area. Fair enough. Blue mackerel. Okay. Put you right there. I'll keep fishing. I'm a fishing kind of guy. No, another blue mackerel. Little, little pull. Little pull. Another blue mackerel. Okay. Okay. Still, still got many fish in the water here. Would love to keep this going. I'm just gonna fill up my whole damn inventory with some mackerel. Mackerel is is a is a good uh, good easy fish. We we like an, a nice mackerel. Just gonna continue. Eh, some of them are different sizes as well. Practically worthless, but enough to stave off hunger. I mean, look, I I said it was a nice fish. What what more do you want from me? Okay, the stock has been depleted. Um, send me time only advances when you're moving, fishing, or taking other actions. Okay. That's fine. Take me, take me over here. What happens if I dock over here? Okay. I'm docking. Dock worker. I love the bent cigarette sticking out of his mouth. You look lost, fisherman. Are you after somewhere to sell your catch? Greater Marrow's on the west side of the bay. We don't want your smelly mackerel over here. Keep an eye on the lighthouse, eh? Wouldn't want to lose sight of it for too long. Okay, well, clearly you freaking hate me, so... Although, wait a minute. There is a traitor here. Oh, now this guy is actually... This dude's got... I guess he's wearing a, a scarf, maybe? I thought this was his beard underneath his beard. You enter a brightly lit shop packed with antiques. Shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you. Hello? Is that... No. I don't believe we've met. Hi, is this Olanky? Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice with you today? Uh, yes, I have some fish. <laughs> Sell all trinkets for zero dollars and zero cents. Okay, um, see ya. Unfortunately, not going to be too useful for me. Okay, um, sure, let's, let's check out. We got some fish over here. I do see, uh, I see a, a bottle over here. Can I, can I go to said bottle? I don't know what this is, but it seems useful enough. Collect item. 21st of August, 1927 was added to the cabin. I just added, uh, I just added a damn date to my, my inventory. We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of Greater Marrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and struck the front of the boat. Did not penetrate the hull, but it jostled us around a few times and a few items fell into the water. Okay. Sounds good. You 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 just do you. Okay, you do you. Let, let's do some more fishing here. I do have to make sure I make it back before night. It's currently 4 o'clock in-game. A minute passes every second, so it is what it is. Like, oh, wait, what? Shapes in the deep? I don't have the right equipment for this spot. Okay. That was not fish, now that I think about it. Oh, but that's... That's like a damn shark, man. What what the hell are we doing here? I don't have the right equipment for this. This is oceanic water. I'm going to turn around and leave, okay? And the, the area is starting to get a little messy, okay? It's starting to get a little messy. Select your lights by, by doing... Oh, what the frick? Foghorn? Oh, yeah. Uh, now that. I'm a big fan of spyglass. Yo... Love that too, but sure, I'll turn my lights on. Okay, big fan of that. Oh yeah, baby. Hit me with a little more fishing. Got some disturbed water here. Just, just gonna do some nice, uh, some nice pulling. An arrow squid. That's my favorite uh, '80s band, man. I like Walk This Way. By them. Um. Okay. Keep it going. I got too much stuff in my inventory, man. This, this is where, where crap's going to hit the fan. Is I don't know how I'm fitting this squid in here. I don't know how I'm fitting this squid in here, man. Drop the mackerel. Just discard him. 
The squid's got to be more useful than the damn mackerel. Give me back. Exposure to fog and other things increases your panic. Okay, let's go home. Let's go home. That sounds like a, a fantastic situation. Welcome home, ladies and gentlemen. I'm docking. Having a nice dock. You step onto the dock of the Greater Marrow. The mayor is waiting nearby. He's been just sitting there waiting for me all day. I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. We should discuss the matter of your boat. Your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired, but I'm more than happy to sell you a replacement vessel, as long as you keep feeding me fish. We'll consider it a loan. I want to make it easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. Okay, you'll need to sell fish at the local market, paying off your debt in return, keeping the population fed and satisfied. I would like to ask where we sell the fish. Local fishmonger will appraise and purchase what you got. Catch, he's open all hours. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Okay, welcome to the fishmonger. Ship loan repayments. I got $50 remaining. It's a capitalism simulator. I, I, I loaded up a Steam Next Fest demo and I have to take part in capitalism. I got loans to repay. Is my education going to drop as I go on as well? Can we maybe set up a 401k? Maybe do some some edge funds. Okay, just <laughs> go to... Oh, man, dude. This guy's been dead for years. <laughs> Flies buzz haphazardly. He's been dead. He, the fish is controlling this man, for sure. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What, what happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out there. Not a life for everybody. Not everybody can collect fish. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Other towns on other islands might pay you different, but you've got debt here. Let's see what you got. I'll sell all my fish for $147. That sounds good. Now, why... What is this over here? Why, why are there little little things in my cargo now? Would you like to explain to me what the little things in my cargo are? The mayor's standing outside the fishmonger store. Excellent. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide. Look here, I found this by the dock. I'm not sure someone like you could make use out of it. Th those little icons are gone? Why don't you take it? This is a research part. Curious looking component. Could be used to develop new equipment. Would need some investigation at a dock first. Okay. So, sure. I'm going to take you. One last thing. Local shipwright. Mentioned she might be able to make some modifications. Okay, so welcome to the ship, right? Oh, she's actually the best character yet. We stand strong women in the fishing market. As you walk into the yard, you see the ship, right? Making repairs to the damaged hull. She looks at you briefly before turning back to her work. At least say hi, right? You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payments up front. This is a capitalistic society, I've learned. Everything takes some time to install. If you take any damage from the rocks, I can patch it up. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards all well above the waterline are splintered and scratched. Take a look around. Just The bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So this is a simple skimmer. A lightweight rod suited to catching fish that live in the shallows. 75 gold for this? Why did I say gold? Like I'm freaking in the pirate age. Fishing speed goes up. Takes two hours to install this crap. Or we got the weighted line. Can catch larger and deeper fish. I would love to get this. Right? I would love to get that. We also got um, some better engines. Um, so what, what what's going on? This is a peculiar engine. 14 knot speed. This is a 10 knot speed. Why the hell would I buy this? Well, I suppose I could install two engines at once, um, and then we go up to 24 knot speed. That seems okay. Don't have any trawl nets. We do have some lights. Some cracked bulbs increase our our stuff. Let, let's just vibe for right now, okay? Ship loan repayment. Okay, do me a favor. Let's do some research. What the frick is this? Use parts to research new equipment. Okay. Research equipment will appear for sale. That's kind of cool. So we only got two things that are available in the demo. The, the flexible fishing pole, a hybrid design allowing for a more flexible fishing style, or the hydraulic rod. Mechanically assisted reels allow the catching of significantly larger species. None of this is available in the demo. Okay, 
I, w I will not worry about this then. Not available in the demo. Um, and these, I can't even click into these. So, I mean, there's all kinds of stuff that will be available in the full game. Um, hit me with a little rest for right now. Okay. Just gonna rest until dawn. We wake up at 6 a.m. in this house. Uh, let's undock. Let, let's go back out fishing, man. I like it so far. It's, it's going completely fine. Let's try to do a little bit further exploration. We, we still have, I see, bottles out there, right? We, we got stuff all the way out there. I want to just... I want to do some happy... Happy explore here today. So let's make it here. What, what bottle we got here? The 20th of August, 1927 was added. So this, this is before the accident. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the island in the inlets. I love the rocks here until he crashes into them. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor. So I know he will keep his hand on the wheels instead of the rods. I can't even make the joke, to be honest with you. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. Did a fancy renaming ceremony. I think he took it more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's important to perform it correctly, lest you uh, want ill fortune to follow the vessel. He wanted to throw away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean's Riches. Okay. Cool. I'm with it. Um, now, I don't believe that my ship can actually catch anything out here. But I'm going to at least give it, like, a solid try. Just kidding. I totally can. So, let's, let's fish you. I got me another cod. We love to see the cod. This has been depleted already. Okay, see ya. I mainly just want to find... So, like, there's a dock over there, right? So, what What if What if we can do something with that? I just got to get some fish to make some money. I should, I should probably should not be exploring this far today. Um... But I'm, I'm obviously intrigued. Like, why have a dock here? Am I about to learn something? I'm gonna dock? What's going on? This is just steel point. You can do some research. Okay. So, I, I understand. So, we, we could go out and rest. Right? This is a shipwreck? Yo, hold on. Shapes in the deep. I don't have the right equipment. That is interesting, though. So, we, we theoretically could end up getting some stuff right probably some good stuff yeah i don't have the right equipment to do any of this stuff okay take me back i do see a small campsite over there i like the exploration man i i think that that's probably these are some manta rays i don't have the right equipment for that fair enough <laughs> sos yo can i rescue this poor dude Come, hop on the boat man hop on the boat i'm i'm here to save you <laughs> okay i just wanted to i just wanted to save your soul man <laughs> damn it time does fly in this game while you while you're having a good boat ride man okay well we're gonna need to probably repair the hull yeah i've taken a damage oh damage eats up a spot that's interesting that's very interesting uh okay let's make it home uh, I, there's the lighthouse, so we, we know how to make it home. This is a frick load of fish. I, I need the, I need to get some fish, man. Give, give me, give me some good fish. Oh, baby. And it's gonna, it's gonna be a spicy, it's just kidding, it's a cod. We like cod in this house, though. We are completely fine with some cod. Cod sells for the big one. Everybody, everybody eats and consumes a, a nice cod. It's been depleted already? There were so many fish there. What's your pro? Okay, that's fine. Maybe you didn't have the right equipment to save the guy. It's possible. I, w I would not argue against it. Uh, it's getting dark. I probably should go home. But I think they're going to just, like, kick me out if I uh, go home and I don't have enough money. So, well, we're going to see what happens when we're out late. I um, feel like it, it could end up being extremely horrible. Yeah, I can't see. Oh, I understand. So, it, it becomes a higher chance of us... Crashing into the freaking rocks like I almost just did. Can't do this. Uh, do you see this eye acting kind of weird? That eye on the top of the screen is having is having a damn good time. I'd like to return home if that's okay. All right. The eye is not happy for sure. <laughs> it is very very not happy. I'd like to dock, please. Okay. Um. So let's go to the fishmonger 
I've had a special order come through uh, uh, from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above normal prices. That sounds sick, actually. One gulf flounder and one gray eel. You'll need to have a rod that can handle shallow water. Okay. That's great to know. Sell all these fish for 105. Huge, honestly. My debt has been adjusted. Dude, we're getting close to, to repaying you. Your boat's looking a little banged up. You know what? That's fair. I'd like you to repair that spot, please. And then I would like to buy um, this weighted line. Because I can. So, oh, so interesting. It can only go in certain areas. And it's going to take three hours to install that. Oh, that, that, went, that went pretty fast. <laughs> okay. Interesting. This is research part still just kind of chilling. Um, so this catch is coastal. This catch is shallow. So I still have to keep them. Oh, hello. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern. Why are you here? Uh, I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back on the path. That is not ominous in any way. Uh, let's just get some rest. Do a little rest up till dawn. Um, get my panic gone. We do have a message from the mayor. Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow? Will you give this package to the dock worker? Absolutely. Dude, this game is cool. This game's really cool. They, they be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Okay, don't forget to check your compass or your map. I didn't know we had a map. But that's, that's cool to know. Little M. Oh, oh dude. Okay. I love it. So we got a steel point. That's the dock we were at earlier. And then there's another one over there. Okay, dude, dude, I'm with it. I'm with it. Really neat game so far. I'm enjoying this a lot. Um, they they drip feed you in the story. Like the base mechanic of just doing the fishing. Um, I actually still enjoy it. I think it's a good fishing mechanic. But it would get old if it was just like sell fish, keep going. It turns into a little bit of like an idle game with a couple more steps. But they're drip feeding you story and quests and, and all this other stuff, which makes this a, it makes it really neat. A delivery. Let's see here. What if it's like a uh, chloroform? Tears a small hole and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels like he's shielding it from your view. Yep. Nice and fresh. This will do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. I was given this old book a few weeks ago. It didn't make much sense to me. Sustainable fishing. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps read it while you're on the water. Okay. I mean, I'll hit you. So I have uh, sustainable fishing. Read to unlock. I'm reading. Select it as active book. Pass time to read. Okay. <laughs> sure. So, I mean, let's, 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 let's take some bets right here right now. What was in the package? Okay. Because I'm going to tell you right now. I know what was in the package. It was human being. That's what was in the package. A golf flounder. Yo. We litty though. Is freaking insane. And it was a, a trophy caught fish. A severed arm. Yeah, like it was definitely a human body part. The cyclopean flounder. He's freaking crate. Dude, I'm about to make bank from this. What if it was a bomb? Would it really be nice and fresh if it was a bomb, man? <laughs> is it like potion craft for fishing, man? I'm extremely with it so far. I'm I'm having I'm having a whale of a time. Okay, just just shut up for two seconds. Um, I should go home, man. I don't got no space. This will just be a nice. We'll have a nice uh lunch trip out. And then we'll uh, we'll return in the future. I'm having a good time. And and I, I probably don't need my spyglass. So put my foghorn on. <laughs> Just letting you know I'm coming right now. This is a demo? Yes, this is a demo. Demos are insane these days, man. They're like actually so good. You got any fish for that order? Yes, I do. Leave whatever you got here. Here's your golf flounder. I'm going to give you the crappy one. And then you need this gray eel. Okay. That's fine. Come back when you got business. What is it today? You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Now this is the sort of specimen to liven up my day. Yeah, you really, <laughs> you're really looking livened up right now. Runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish as though feeling for something. 
pushes from one side of its stomach and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open and from its stomach he pulls out a piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. A delicately patterned handkerchief? What the frick? I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing and I'll pay you for the fish too. There was a handkerchief inside the fish and he just gave it to me? It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen. I'm sure you'll find more before too long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Handkerchief. A once beautiful handkerchief drawn from the insides of a grotesque fish. What the frick? Okay. Um, I'd like to move that to my storage, please. Sure. What the frick? Okay. Sell all fish for, for 89. Absolutely. Thank you. Oh, honestly, all in all, that was weird. Oh, what the frick is this guy? Man looking at you through your cabin window? His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. You took freaking fish. You son of a gun. You brought him fish. I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay, cut south. I have a business proposition you'll want to hear. Dude, I'm losing my mind. This game is sick. <laughs> this game is so good. Why? I'm loving this. Okay, well, like, immediately, of course we're gonna go do that. So how do I get to my storage? The mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood with a spring in his step. Fantastic news, thanks partly to your efforts. Greater Marrow's growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I even saw a dude staring out of a window, uh, calmly muttering to himself about uh, going on a mission with you. I'm granted a consent for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational. Allocated some money to improve the fishmonger service. What the frick? We're unlocking so much. What's the dry dock? We make significant improvements to your vessel. Extra space. More attachment points. Yo. How do I get materials? There's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks. Sure you'll find a way to get at them. Materials assigned towards upgrades here will be stored. Don't worry if you only have half of what we need. What the frick? Select an upgrade project to begin adding materials. Um, I would like to have more... Not available in demo, not available in demo, not available in demo. I would like to have none of it. <laughs> I would like to uh, ensure we have none of these things. Okay, get me the frick out of here, man. Get me out of here. I gotta go south. So I'm meeting this dude south. Um, we can't stop for fish. We, we have to make this happen now. Does he live at this weird house? I'm gonna tell you, um, this is pretty, pretty straightforward going here to meet, right? But, but that's fine. Let's, let's go say hi. The demo's coming to an end, I guess. Yeah, so probably sometime soon. It'd be so funny if we started talking to this dude and it was just not available in demo over and over. Blackstone Isle, okay, the ruined mansion. Oh, the man is standing in the doorway watching you approach, holding an old book in hand. You came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. Testing my vocabulary today. You have something for me. It's Ron Offerman? Not Ron. Nick Offerman? I, Ron Swanson and Nick Offerman combined the Ron Offerman. Honestly, this man's now Ron Offerman. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to a flickering light and studies it. Yes, indeed, came from a fish. These patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, the handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for that sank many years ago. Carried items of great importance. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment to let you dredge the wrecks in dark depths. Find me these lost relics. I will reward you in ways beyond all imagining. You need not give up your fishing career. I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. Uh, freaking absolutely. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. Took like a half hour, man. The relics we're looking for are a ring, a necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. Okay. Sure. I would encounter you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences. Return when you have something. I want to take a look at your workshop real quick. Looks like it has been used in decades. I'll go inside. It's locked. Great, great work, everybody. Great work. Okay. Get, get me out of here. We would like to catch some fish on the way back, but it getting dark, dude. It getting dark. 
Uh, I see, I see, uh, important things over here. We're obviously getting, like, a little afraid, but what, what if I came over here? You don't have the right equipment. That's fair. Um, keep in mind there's gonna be rocks. You gotta, you gotta be careful. I know this is not the correct place to dock, but I could just, like, rest here for the night, right? Seems like a great idea. Plus, we'll probably have another, uh, story event right here. Are my lights on? Yes, they are, I believe. Um, grieving father. <laughs> Hello, is everything okay? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Well, yes, you see, my son was lost at sea years ago. He's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks, all alone in the cold, dark water. Brother, your son is dead. He's freaking dead. Man's clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grief rack his body. I was wondering. I noticed you have some dredging equipment. Can you bring my son's body back? If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings, I think I'd feel more at peace. He wore a bronze belt buckle. Okay. The only strange occurrences? I don't get out a lot anymore. The new World of Warcraft update launched, and I just can't stop. But I do remember the old mayor in his final days. What an awful sight. Screaming and throwing things into the sea. Throw it back, he would cry over and over, begging anyone who would listen. This is fricked. Anything else I can help you with? Yeah, I'd better go, honestly. I don't have anything for this guy. Um, find anything special? Nope. I mean, there was a handkerchief, but I gave that to a weird old man on an island. So, uh, let's, let's rest for a little bit. That seems like a good situation. And we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep things going. We'll keep things going. Let's undock. Let's get a couple more fish. Um, I see some fish right here. We're still looking for that eel. And there, there's shallow water around here for sure. This is coastal water. I mean, look, you, you still need money. Okay, you still need money. A couple of cod ain't gonna hurt you. We, we got some early morning fishing going. Get get our cod nice and happy. I don't know what's here, but I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna peep it. A little peep, the coastal water. Probably need to go like closer to the uh, closer to the damn shore for some nice shallow water. And and we're going to want to hit the shipwreck. I mean, honestly, we're going to probably want to hit the shipwreck like immediately. This is just another flounder, man. I'm realizing that the the shape of the fish is in the middle. Oh, you just said that. The fish in the middle is the fish you get. Look at that. Today I learned T I L. How about right here? This Oh, what the frick is this? Inspect a floating buoy serves as a, to mark a, a passage. The dim light provides a respite. Okay, go for it. Some coastal water. It's a it's a insane blue mackerel. Not the most insane, but he, he's not bad. Sure, I'll put that there. I don't have any space for this. I, I ain't got no space for this. Just just discard it. It's only a mackerel, man. No one gives a damn about the mackerels. Let's go back real quick. Um, let's go back real quick. Little, little dock me up. Real real nice. Uh, fishmonger. We got tons of stuff going on. You got fish for that order? I don't. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean to. Um, I'm going to sell 114 fish. Very good. And then let's, let's talk to some people. So the builder. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside staring out to sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? It's peaceful, honestly. Got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town. All right, think I need to get away for a while. It's not so bad here. Just gazing out, lost in thought. Say, if you find me materials, maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. Steel point. Two units of lumber, two units of scrap, all I need. Stack it up at steel point. Okay, uh, hi, lighthouse keeper. What is it? Um, okay. Do you know of any shipwrecks? Eyes you. There's a spot near the back of Greater Marrow. Sometimes you can see an unnatural glow. Okay. Sure. Who lives on Blackstone? I saw that ill-fated boat return. I chose to look the other way. Watch an unnatural glow flicker, th flicker through those windows. Whatever you got planned, I hope you know what you're doing out there. Any strange things? I see plenty of strange things. Okay. Are you really standing here in front of me, or is this just another of the fog's tricks? Okay, weirdo. What do you know of the old mayor? I try not to think about him. Okay. What a what a little weirdo, honestly. I don't want to talk to her anymore. She kind of scares me. Um, okay, let's... 
I'm almost done reading this damn book too. Uh, we got search for relics, place for, I mean, there's tons to do, man. Belt buckle near Little Marrow. So Little Marrow is over there. So we want to go on the back side of that. But I'm going to actually, let, let's go, let's go a little closer. Okay, I'm going to go to the thing that's around the back side of this sucker. And, and we're going to see, we're going to see what's going on. So slip me through this way. Obviously the rocks are going to make this difficult coming home, but... Uh, and we got what appears to be some materials that I can now dredge out of the water. So, start dredging. My brain is extremely hurting. How the hell does this work? Oh, I get it. Okay, I get it. Just wait. Just wait. Bang, bang. Oh, I get it. I get it. You gotta, you gotta avoid them. Okay. It's a worn gold ring. Sorry, I did not realize how difficult that was. I spent about eight hours out here. I'm just going to go home, I think. <laughs> I also finished reading my book. 10% chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Sure. Thanks. Um, might as well catch some fish right here. Uh, this is a new fish. A black grouper. I should not be fishing right now. I should go home. I should go home. Maybe the- dude, eels come out at night, right? That's the thing. What if I got a fish at night to get the eel? That'd be kind of big brain. Dredge? Like, the name of the game? Damn straight, dude. Damn straight. Okay, fishmonger. I found this book out back. Could be useful. Okay, rods, reels, and rigs. My favorite. My favorite. Okay. Then I got a new book that I can read. Let's get that going. Selected as my active book. Um, let's at least talk to you. So, I mean, I, I should buy another one of these, right? So let's let's install that for two hours, real nice and quick. Um, some better lights. No reason not to, right? No reason not to. Let let's install that for an hour. It's like midnight. My dude's got to get some sleep at some point, but I don't have materials. Yeah, I don't. I can't even do any of that. Go to sleep, please. Go to sleep. Let, I want to I wanna go... Um, I want to go... Oh, dude, we're way faster. What the frick? We're zooming? I want to do some dredging, okay? Some proper dredging. Those are some big sharks, man. Those are some big sharks. Here's some materials. We definitely want to get this. So just, just do some proper dredge work today. Proper dredge work. A bolt of cloth. Okay, I dredge. Honestly, the dredging minigame is very fun. Having different minigames for, for different things is actually, like, really cool. That's really cool. I like that a lot. I was half expecting just the same thing again. Um, but the fact there is something different is, is super cool. Okay, so there, there's clearly something over here. This is just... This is the eel. This is the eel. Don't frick this one up for me. Oh, baby. A gray eel. I'm gonna put you right there, actually. So we're gonna complete that quest, which is great. Put you right there. Do a little one of these. Love it. Okay. The the sex bot is back in the YouTube comment sections. We love to see it. Get, get them out of there. Get fricked, loser. Okay, where, where are we dredging, man? We dredging right here? No, this is just disturbed water again. I would like to... Oh, that's the shipwreck, baby. That's the shipwreck. Okay. Let's do it. Start dredging. This this is... Oh, dude, this is a proper dredge. Oh, we, we zooming? <sighs> Relic discovered the ornate key. Uh, we're pogging. Holy frick. It's an insane insane thing what are you oceanic water don't don't have the materials for that okay um we gotta go home but let, let's go home a different route okay can i can i uh can i get you guys coastal water that's just some mackerel those are some flounders or some stingrays one those are some stingrays man let, let's let's do it sting oh what the frick is huge I can't put you in my damn situation that I'm in. 
I actually can't fit this son of a gun. He's massive. Okay. Um. <laughs> I, I can't fit you. Okay, I'm just gonna discard you then. Can't can't fit this son of a gun. That's fine. See ya. Um, catch you later. Let's go home. What the frick? Stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air. Faint shapes dance upon its surface. I'll place my hand on the stone. Cold stone does not respond to your touch. Okay, weirdo. I gotta go home, man. I gotta go home. What the hell is this? All that's left of this boat is an old husk. You pull a little closer. I'll look inside. Found items. A research part that I can't use. A ring. Okay. An old iron chain. I'll, I'll buy. This, this wood's gonna be tough, man. This wood's gonna be tough. I, 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 can, I can return to these items later. That's fine. We, we know where some wood is. That, that's good to know. That's very good to know. Those are... That's just more parts, man. No, that's disturbed water. Just kidding. It's time to go home. Time to go home. I just, I just slipped through here. That's all. Uh, it's sparkling here. Lighthouse towers above waves crashing endlessly. All creatures would would have had their brittle bodies broken and thrown at his feet. What the frick? <laughs> Little weirdo. <laughs> okay. Let's go back. Let's go back. Give me a little park job. You gotta find the hand of the dead guy to touch the stone. Let's not get too freaky, okay? I do have the fish for this. Here you go. Wraps up the fish, hands you some money. They should be pleased. Couple squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see people fishing squid. They only feed at night. Okay, good to know. Um, sell all this fish. Dude, I got way too much crap in my inventory right now. Let's um talk to the shipwright real quick. I can't do anything with you. I, I legit can't do anything with you. Um, You know what? Frick it. I should not do this. But the only way that I'm getting space in my inventory is by uh, going and selling some stuff. So I'm going to just sail over to here. There's no rocks in the way. I don't have any fear about this. Obviously, my panic is going to go up a little bit, but... It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Just, just go here real quick. I know the mansion guy is going to need some stuff too, but the relic guy is going to need some things as well. So the trader found anything special? Yeah, I'll sell all my trinkets for 47 money. Fantastic. But then relic guy is going to obviously take the ornate key. So you're just kind of vibing. You guys are still having a good time. I'm going to rest here. And then we're going to wake up and we're going to go to... Uh, we're going to go to Relic Guy. Absolutely deserved. I'm extremely bad at the game. <laughs> going to gonna have to do some repairs as well. Good thing I have money. Okay. Thanks for the, the piece of wood. We can drop the wood off at Black Isle for the one lady as well. Or I can see if I can use it on my own ship. But let's, let's snag that stuff. Okay. Let's go. Little mansion guy. You know what? Before we go to the mansion guy... No, yeah, you know what? I am going to go here first. This looks to be important to me. Nope, this is just eel. Never mind. Here I was thinking it was important. Here's more, more black rock. Stone hums quietly. Place your hand on the stone. Does not respond to my touch. I mean, who knows? Maybe the hand of the weird dead guy. Maybe that's the, the vibe. But I'm, I don't want to think about that. That seems kind of kind of weird. Okay. Um. Hello. Well, you have something, don't you? The ornate key. There you go. Happy birthday. Is that all? Where's the lock? He grows agitated. Are you freaking kidding me right now? I gave you what you want. Raise the truth in dredge. That's the end of the demo, baby. That's the end of the demo. This is a really, really neat little game, man. I actually think this is super cool. Um, kind of toes a fine line between being just like a fishing idol game uh, and obviously being a full-blown RPG with a lot of interesting quests and designs. In the future, obviously, you just want to see more, right? You, you want to see more unique quests. Like, if it continues to just be what we saw, then it's going to get old quick. But if you're going to continue to expand upon the idea of it over and over and over... 
um, and, and add more unique abilities and things like that. I mean, obviously you have fishing with a net, you have uh, other upgrades you can get. It could end up being insanely good. You can wishlist this uh, on Steam right now. Uh, it comes out in 2023. Uh, so we still got a little bits to go before we, we can get our hands on the full copy uh, of this game. But you can play this demo right now, chapter one of the game, um, and see what there is to see in Dredge. Very fun game. Very good experience. Uh, we'll, we'll catch it out when it fully releases.